Hello everyone! For this video, it's going to be something really interesting. So this comes from a very reliable source. I have obviously redacted their name in order to protect them. But if you recall last year, uh, when GT was still going on, uh, there were listings that appeared that basically confirmed there was going to be another season uh, for Beyblade Burst. And that was really exciting. It turns out it was true. So I think this is going to be a very, very similar case. Obviously, just wait. Just wait. We technically can't say not 100%, but I'm, I'm very, very, very confident that we are getting at least one more season and the listings are indeed true. If they end up not being true, they're not true, but I'm very sure. Now, keep in mind, these are just like listings. We don't know anything else. So what I'll do is I'm going to go through the listings, right? We're going to go over it one by one. I'm going to give my thoughts afterwards, that way there's no confusion. So we're going to get started. So first, let's go over what we already know leading up to the end of this year. So going over to what we already know, Lucifer is going to come out at the end of this month on was it, November 28th? The 28th, whatever's the last Saturday of November, yeah, 28th. And the Lumi Breaks Day comes out in like a few days from now. Okay, November's out of the way. What about December? Other than the Metal Fight Remix it, which I don't really count, <laughs> uh, there's the Random Booster Volume 23. Now we do 23? 23. We don't know when that Random Booster is going to come out. We don't know what bays are going to be in it. We only know it's supposed to be an attack prize bay. My speculation is what I'll get to afterwards. Actually, no, actually, no. Yeah, we, we just covered this here. Okay, yeah, yeah. So for the random booster, my speculation is the prize bay could either be Excalibur or Death Scyther. I'm leaning towards Death Scyther for two reasons. One, Daigo is very popular. Very, very popular. He appears in the manga. I'm pretty sure he, appear, he appears in the manga for Sparking. I believe he is a manga legend. I'm just going to search Daigo. I don't remember what ranking he is. He is 14 in S. Two, they made these new high drivers, right? And they did high Jaggy Dash. So how easy would it be for TT to do high Jaggy Dash purple and just put it on the Death Side Revolution? It, it, it's really easy. Because Excalibur is less likely for the simple reason that it's kind of hard to make Excalibur into like a sparking bay. Like it just, like unless they fuse the chip, then maybe, but it would just look weird. It's like Apocalypse's chip uh, for Rise for Hasbro. It just looks weird when the when the sword's not there. They'd have to really like do crazy design for it just to make it look somewhat plausible. But okay, we don't know what the prize bay is for December. But I was just going over. Now let's go over to what comes after this year, just to get an idea. Uh, so going over that, it seems, yeah, we already know, B177 is supposed to be a booster, which I believe is supposed to be a defense type bay, and is a legend blader. And I believe it's supposed to be like some kind of old rival defense or something like that. Now I believe it'll probably be a manga legend, right, for B177. Considering, right, considering the fact that it's a legend blader and who are the defense types again that are confirmed in the rankings? I think it's Wakia, Gwyn, and Fi. I would lean towards Wyvern just because it's the easier out of the two to produce and they can just easily do like 1D Hurricane Orbit Metal. You know what I mean? So it's not really like impossible just to pull off a Wyvern. I feel like Wyvern is the most likely. but. Time will tell. Maybe it's Phoenix, maybe it's Genesis, we don't know. Or maybe it's something else. Moving on, we of course got a random booster volume 24 for February, B178. So for that one, I'm stumped. I do not know. Now for the prize bay, I'm assuming we will get a Metal Fight remake. Because for the GT booster that was in February, I believe, we had Burn Phoenix as the prize bay, and the other one are just gold turbos. Okay, so what bay could they pick for Metal Fight uh, as a remake for the prize bay? If they follow the same trend that they've done before. Okay. I think it's between either Twisted Temple 
or Evil Befall? I think. Now I'm leaning towards Evil Befall because they've because Temple would just have yielding, but maybe they do Temple. It doesn't really matter because they usually don't tend to repeat. Uh, they wouldn't really just. Yeah, they don't really repeat the parts in the remix. They make sure they're all different. They could do yielding. Well, if they did tempo, I'd assume wheel yielding. But again, time will tell. We don't know anything. And the thing is, too, it could just be a normal booster and tempo is just the prize bay. But they've done this thing with Drigger Fang where it's always been, like, rares. <laughs> and I don't know. They could do, like, GT Lottery prize bays in the booster, but slightly different, maybe? Or maybe they're, like, saving all the double chassis just to be colored on, like, bays in the booster. So I have no idea. My guess is maybe just like color double chassis in the random booster for February, maybe. Because that's maybe that's why they're holding off the double chassis. Or who who knows, man? Who knows? Moving on from that, there is B179, which is a booster. Now they've made sure to say that the booster is not with the new series. So B179 is a booster, and I guess B hmm. That's interesting. What about B180? Hmm, so B179 is the new booster, but B180 is when it actually uh, starts. Huh, so what could be B179 being a booster? Because I don't think there's going to be any other... Okay, actually, you want to know what? I think I might have an idea what B179 is. Now, someone can correct me if I am wrong, but I do believe, all right, that, that they did this... It's like some poll or whatever for the legends, like a voting thing. Voting? I gotta find it. It was like some voting thing or some like campaign where you can vote on what's the on um, uh, a beta evolve or something. To my memory, like a legends voting or something. I do believe. I can't find it off the top of my head, but. Uh, I do believe there's something like that. Maybe the bay that you have to vote is for the B179. Is it 179? Let me just double check. I want to do so many numbers. I just got to double check. I believe maybe that could be the case or it's just something else. I don't know. Or maybe... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We don't know what, the B, we don't know what any of this stuff is. We're just speculating on it right now. Then after that, for the new series, it seems April is going to be stacked. It's saying that for April, it is going to be a booster, a random booster, dear god, a stadium set, a new stadium, a new launcher, and then after in May there's a booster. You know how stacked April is? Like, that is insane. That is insane. There is like so much. Now obviously, time is gonna tell for what it is or what it isn't, but I'm leaning towards the positive side. I hope it's gonna be good. I hope for the random boosters that TT doesn't botch it. I am praying that the random booster for December at least has a good selection. Like Infinite Achilles was not bad for its selection. I just hope this, like the, the, the booster to end off the year has a good selection. That's all I want. That's all I want. Afterwards, I, I don't know. I, I have no clue. Obviously, when the stuff comes out, we'll be reviewing it. I'm all for a new season slash series, which is still Beyblade Burst, obviously. So let me know your thoughts in the comments. What do you think the releases could be? Now, what we know that's confirmed is 177 is supposed to be a Legend Bladers, which is probably in reference to, obviously, the manga. Legend Bladers through that ranking, and it's a defense type. We already know that December is supposed to be an attack type prize bay, which definitely should be probably one of the manga legends. The rest, who knows? So I want to say thank you for watching. Time will tell for all this stuff, but I hope you have an awesome and amazing day.